Hey, I'm Chris, and today I'm going to be showing you how to add a sustain in Resample Omatic 5000. So let's quickly add Resample Omatic to a virtual instrument track and browse for a random sample. Electric piano sounds good. Cool. So, if I press the keyboard and hit sustain, not much happens. Uh, even when I obey the note offs and hit sustain, nothing. That's because Resample Omatic doesn't have a sustain ability. This sampler is very, very basic, but we can add it in. So, to add it in, we simply check this Obey Notes Off and go into the Parameters menu. It will show that the last touch is on Obey Notes Off and we're just going to MIDI link it to a CC message. That CC message is 64, which is the sustain pedal on MIDI devices. So now it's linked. And when I hit the sustain, so it's pressing the button, but it's doing the opposite. We want it to obey the note offs when the sustain is not pressed, and unobey the note offs when the sustain is pressed. So we need it reversed. So we go back into parameters. And now there's a checkbox on these two. We're going to hit the top one, the parameter modulation slash MIDI link. And what we're going to simply do is these, this top and this bottom slider, we're going to inverse. Which basically means when the sustain pedal is on, we're going to do the opposite and turn this checkbox off. And when the sustain pedal isn't held, it's going to enable that checkbox. So that's without sustain. And that is with sustain. Now, the only problem here is that when you press sustain a note and take it off before the sample plays, it won't re-enable that note off. It won't cut off that note. It will play that full sample. But otherwise, that's a pretty simple way of adding in a sustain pedal to resample Omatic. Uh, 